Thank you very much for showing interest in the digital single market. My name is Niels Rauer. I'm a partner in the field of intellectual property, doing namely copyright law. And uh, I have the pleasure of co-heading our DSM digital single market team here at Hogan Lovells. Please allow me to take you to a journey and to explain you a little bit um, about what DSM is all about. Um, the idea of a single market is by no means new. When the founding members came together in the mid-late 50s, what they had in mind was already an area of economic free trade where goods and services could circulate on a free basis. Now, what we have achieved over time in the analog world does not reflect the existing situation on the internet. To give you an example, if a German consumer wishes to buy goods or receive services, let's say from a French website, it every now and then happens that he can't do that because he's rerouted to the German interface of the company. That's what we call geo-blocking and you will agree with me this is contradictive to the overall idea of a single market. So what the European Commission did in uh, the last couple of years, they came up with a strategy for a digital single market. This was first announced on May 6, 2015. Now, one should not think of like a single act now implementing a digital single market. No, it's, it's a whole bucket of initiatives, directives, regulations, communications, which together shall bring about the digital single market. Now, they have uh, categorized the initiatives they have in mind in three pillars. So when you look at the in, uh, in total 16 areas of focus the European Commission has announced, you have like three pillars which you find on the slide which you see right now. The first pillar is about better access for consumers and businesses to digital goods and services across Europe. The second pillar is about maximizing the growth potential of the digital economy. And the third pillar is creating the right conditions and level playing field for digital networks and innovative services to flourish. So this is in a nutshell what the digital single market is about. We have further videos where we guide you through the initiatives in detail and of course you can visit our website on the www.dsmwatch.com. Thank you very much.